Hello everyone, if you can hear this. So, the stream will be starting soon. Just tell me if there's any problems with the stuff that's going on. And, yeah. Can you hear me properly? Hello everyone, if you can hear this. Oh good, yep, so I can, I can, I've heard it on my phone now. Looks like it's working, so that's good. I'll be doing the chat on a different laptop, which is all good. Uh, I've brought up two now, so I'm ready. And it looks like the stream is active, so we have no viewers at the moment, so I'll be waiting to start the stream. We currently have one watcher. I'm not sure who it is, but if they say in chat, then say hi. Hello, whoever's watching. Uh, welcome to the stream. Uh, hello, Jamie Stewart. No, I'm not doing a face reveal quite yet, but maybe in a future stream. Um, maybe in a future video. Maybe for a thousand subscribers, 500. See how long it takes to get there. So thanks for coming to the stream. So we'll be starting. I'll start the build in a while after after a couple more people turn up. And for now, we can do a bit of a Q and A or something. So, what, tell me what you thought of my video today. It was a review of, I believe, I did the, yep, the first, no, 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 the Y Wing Microfighter, which was a pretty cool set. Yeah. And I'm glad to have got it. I'm going to see if, uh, going to try and get some more people on, text, message some people, share the stream about if you want me to start building sooner, because that. Is what I would like to do. And today I'll be rebuilding or finishing building the uh, the actual Phantom. So I'm nearly done. Just got bag three to do. So yep. Just, just telling some more people to come on, and hopefully we can get a couple more people on the stream. Get up. To... Oh, great! That's good to know. <laughs> Glad that people have been seeing my videos. That's encouraging. Say hi to him for me. Yeah. Um. Just encouraging other people to come on the stream, and I think I'm going to open this bag now, but I'm not building it quite yet. Oh, I guess. Oh, So I think we've got another viewer at the moment. Who is it? Is no. Okay, they've gone. It's strange. So someone joined and just left the stream. So let's start off by building the Thor minifigure in a second. But uh, let's put the let's bring the shooters in here. So I know where they go. I quite like the system that they've got for this set. It's, it's pretty cool. Tell me if there's any problems with the stream and hopefully you can hear me and that's all working. We have a third participant again. They're not coming up. It's strange. <clears throat> right, I'll, I'll build the Thrawn minifigure. It's an interesting uh, hairpiece. It's in dark blue colour. 
Uh, okay, so hopefully a couple more people will come or stop I tell them to share it on Twitter. Yeah, that's about right. Okay. Here's the Thrawn minifigure. I'm going to be taking it slowly today. I've not got much left to build, so hopefully I can do Oh, hello Rebel Brick Productions. Welcome to the stream. Uh, good to see you on here. And thank you for coming, like I mentioned earlier. I've got... I've just built Grand Admiral Thrawn, uh, the minifigure, so... That's where we are. Bag three, and he is looking really cool because I started it yesterday, obviously, in the stream. And there's all three minifigures. Uh, the review will be done hopefully tomorrow because I'll do it straight after building the set. And yeah, the set is really overpriced uh, in the in the UK, but I um in this country. But I managed to get it from the US, which meant it was thirty dollars instead of the regular forty pound price, because forty pounds is really bad for a two hundred and seventy piece set. So getting it for the equivalent of twenty five pounds was really great, and I'm glad I managed to get that. So that's pretty good. Okay. So. If you want to ask me any questions in the chat, uh, no, I'm not probably not doing a face reveal anytime soon, but maybe eventually. If you want to ask any questions in the chat, I'll try and answer them as best as I can. Just try and get into the frame a bit more. So the building's working. Got my uh, nice cup of hot black currant, hot red bean there. Keep me going during the stream because yesterday I was. Yeah, May the 4th. May the 4th is going to be great. I'm going to be going to the Leicester Square store at some point during May the 4th because it's the best place to be. And I'll be hopefully getting as many of the sets as I can because I've been holding back on them up till now, on the new ones. This one I was given as a gift, which is very generous. So. That was that was great because I I didn't actually go to the US but uh, it was given to me because yeah I also managed to get the uh, stamp from the New York Rockefeller Center so I've got three pretty good ones now San Francisco Vancouver and the Rockefeller Center in New York in my passport do I um, do you do your passport the they they don't really seem to do it in the UK but in the US they what they think they've got, they're getting a stamp eventually, but in the US they have a whole lot of stamps from every store. And that piece looks like it goes there. Yeah, this set looks pretty cool. It's probably not worth the £40, but if you can get it on either a really decent, good discount or during double VIP points, i.e. May the 4th, or right now, plus including then an exclusive minifigure, like in the May the 4th one. As well as Grand Admiral Thrawn, he is all. Do I review? Oh, hi, Pez Tech. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. How are, you, how are you doing? Um. So, uh, yep, I'm in the middle of building a new Lego Star Wars set from 2017. Really glad to have this one. So, what are you doing? <laughs> How are you all doing? Bit of like, yeah. There's a bit of a delay on the stream, and I think it's in the. Um, what's the thing? I might have. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna optimize it for less viewer buffering. So it might buffer for a second there whilst I do the change, but hopefully that's a bit better. Uh, I've just applied a sticker. Yeah, I'm trying to do it with two computers. So I've got one filming with the camera. There we go. You might be able to see the thing a bit better. Put my cup away. So, ask any questions you want to ask. Uh, I'll talk about May the 4th if you like. 
Oh, there you go. Yeah, the, the stream is a bit delayed. Okay. Uh, I think I've also got it delayed on this computer. So, see if I can put it slightly less far back. Okay. So, we currently have watching three people. We have Peztech, Rebel Brick Productions, and me on my moderating account. So, if you want to ask any questions about anything, pretty much, there's a chance that it might be slightly more delayed now uh, in terms of how quickly you can do the interaction stuff because I changed the settings there. Um, something wrong with this pit. It's lined up incorrectly. There you go. Move that forward so you can't it's difficult to get it lined up properly. There we go. Where do you normally go to get Lego products? Um, well, generally, most recently I've been going to the Lego store. I haven't really bought many from other places recently, but I know I got a lot from Amazon before. And I do a lot of, I look around on eBay quite a lot, but I haven't really bought many sets on there before. So, generally the Lego store, the certified Lego store, that's probably my favourite place to go. So tell me how the audio quality is. I'm using a different microphone for this video. So it might be a bit odd. I'm not sure what's happening here. This piece is... I haven't really been paying attention to this. So. Okay. Hopefully that works. Oh no, I know what I've done wrong. This is meant to be pushed through. Sorry about this. Okay, the audio is fine. Yeah, I wasn't sure about this microphone. It's a bit of a weird one, but it's probably working out better than the, the uh, computer microphone because that was being a bit echoey yesterday. I've got two computers for the stream at the moment. I'm using, to film it, the camera from a Lenovo Z50 which is all right and then i'm doing the chatting or looking at the chat through a mac, mac what's the stats it's macbook pro but it's yeah it's a 2016 macbook pro 13 inch just if you're interested i know pez tech is interested in technology <laughs> so we now have four watches who is it oh okay i'm not sure it says we all got five likes on the stream which is probably means it's doing better than yesterday's stream uh, already and hopefully I can get through this set and taking it slowly because I don't want it to uh, mess up but yeah okay Yeah, we have my Donnelly Domino's account watching the stream at the moment. I think it's acting as a uh, moderator. So, hopefully that, that works. I'm just going to check something. Watching the stream at the moment, I think Sorry about that. it's acting as a uh, moderator. Probably hit a bit of a weird... Oh, that's fine. Got the audio on. Okay. Everything's on, and I'm going to keep going with this. I think the camera angle's all right. The camera angle's all right. Oh, favourite Rogue One set. Um, well, so far, does that include the new ones, the, the Winter Wave, or is that just the original ones? Just tell me that, and then I'll, then I'll come up with a better answer. Because Think about it. Um. 
Winter Wave as well, right. Um, well, one of my favourites actually is the, uh, I think I've got it right here. Um, I can't quite reach it. Um, yeah, it's, uh, I've got a few favourites. I really like the new uh, Rebel Battle Pack because, and the Imperial one. Uh, the Rebel one's slightly better, I think. And they're both great as, you know, army builders, that sort of stuff. They, um, they're really good sets to get. Uh, they're great for the price as well. But in terms of favourite set, I'd probably say, of the ones I've got, I've got the... Uh, I'll have a look at them. The ATSC looks really awesome, and the TIE Striker is great, because it, um, it, yeah, it's a lot bigger than you'd actually expect as a set. You expect it to be more like a, uh, more like a sort of first resist, no, first order troop transporter, but it's not. It's a lot bigger. It's it's quite a lot of set. Uh, but the Y, the U wing and the Y wing are probably my favourites. Uh, probably the Y wing slightly because of its um, the minifigures. Oh, uh, mm, the Y, the U wing minifigures are great as well. Genoso is a good one to have, isn't she? If you're still watching Pez Tech, have you been to see Rogue One yet? I know you have Rebel Book Productions. Oh, have you been to see. Uh, great film. Great, great, great film. I really want to get the, um, yeah, Rebel Rope Productions, are you getting the, uh, yeah, you, oh, not yet. I'd say even if you're not into Star Wars, the, uh, the storyline is actually really good for a, um, for a Star Wars film. It's not just a repeat of the other ones, it's a brand new story, really good. Um, I'm not sponsored by Disney, you know, hit me up, Disney, I, I'll take a sponsorship from them. Um. <laughs> Yeah, Rogue One's a great film. The Ewing's a great set as well, but what do you think about the, um, the new UCS Snowspeeder? That's the one I'm most excited for this year, probably. Uh, I'm going to hopefully try and get that to review at some point. Maybe May the 4th, because I think it releases on May the 4th, so if I can get it then, I could be one of the first people to review it, hopefully. Which would be quite cool because I haven't really got the chance to do that before. Other than maybe the two the two microfiches that I've got. But I don't really take that. I took ages to review those. The uh, Y one only just went up today, in fact, so watch that after the stream if you like. Stream should be over we started streaming about twenty minutes ago and it should be over pretty soon because this is all I've got left to build this stuff. Uh Sorry, this is what I'm doing. I've got the two pieces of landing gear there. And. Oh, yeah, Rebel Brick Productions. I was talking to a Shadow Man today. Shadow Man 321. And he's just saying how, how nice of a guy you are. <laughs> so I thought I'd pass that on to you. Let's see you at the stream. And I, I agree with him. <laughs> He's been commenting on all your videos recently, I think. Yeah, the, that's the problem with UCS sets. The way the way I got the uh, Slave One was basically in we were on holiday and the exchange rate worked out so that I could pretty much get it for half price. And the X, the, sorry, no, the uh, Sand Crawler I was pretty lucky to get as well because. I had an old, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, the sand cooler, I, I, I had an old Technic excavator, which I got about f five years ago for, um, f well, for my birthday, I uh, uh, can't remember how old I was, something like that, and that was great at the time, but I sold it a couple months ago, and it sold for like three times the price I bought it for, so I managed to get the sand crawler with that and still have some 
left over, which was great. No. It was originally in a hundred pound set and it sold there for um I think three hundred. Which I was pretty amazed at actually because you know most sets you seem tend to get unlucky and have the ones which don't go up in value. But this one did and that was amazing. And Pestech, I know some of the ones that you have too, like the old Technic ones, like the uh, crane thing, they've gone up in value a lot too. Yeah, uh, I have very few like that. I actually have, there's some strange ones like the uh, the Lego City Airport, which is, um, well, I haven't got it built, but it, it, it's about seven, eight years old, and it's one I got when I was really young. and. It's it's strange because it it's it doesn't really sell that often on eBay, it, but it on Amazon it seems to be going new from like six hundred pounds and I I don't really get it. That's, that's a bit strange. So yeah, I generally prefer the smaller sets because well, I prefer the UCS sets because you know the UCS, but it's a lot easier to get the smaller ones. So. I generally tend to get those, you know, easy. Well, not easy, but slightly less painful. It looks like there it is on its landing gear. I'm not sure how this. And it doesn't seem to be quite level, but I think that makes it level. Yeah, that's looking really cool. And now is the you have the oh you sold the Harry Potter castle for two <laughs> awesome yeah that's pretty much the same story with the uh, with the other one I'll just grab the the, the video might go off go off I, I'm gonna grab the uh, no there it is I'm gonna grab the sand cooler. Oh, hey the network, welcome to the stream. <laughs> yeah. It seems to be the uh Star Wars and uh Harry Potter are where it's at. So oh, there, there's the sand cooler. That's what I got with the for your information Pestic, if you're not sure what it is. That's what I got with the uh money from setting that old technique set. Yeah. Hey Ethan Network. Um I, I loved your video earlier. That was pretty crazy actually. Two heavy carriers. Wow. That's such a cool set. <laughs> yeah, it does from this angle. It's <laughs> I'm really glad I managed to I mean I just looked I was looking through all my old sets just seeing what they're worth, if they were worth anything. And pretty impressive that it actually any set for free. Um well I could take it with two approaches. I could go for the most expensive set and then I could, you know, sell that for other sets. So in that case I'd go for the UCS Millennium Falcon, which is an awesome set anyway, but I probably wouldn't get it and keep it because there's so many other things you could get with it. One single set would probably be the UCS Super Star Destroyer, but I doubt I'll ever get that. If, well, in the, at least not real Lego of it. I might get the, at some point, the fake Leppin version, but I'm still sort of undecided about that, so. Don't know whether that's worth it. Yeah, that that's pretty much it, the, the big Super Star Destroyer. So yeah, let's do a couple more questions now, if you want to. I'll uh, answer them because I'm probably going through this too quickly. I want to savour it a bit more. Mm. Yeah, Grand Admiral Thrawn here looks really cool. 
Do any of you know why he's just got the Admiral stripes and not the Grand Admiral insignia? That's that's what I don't really get. It's slightly strange. They didn't give him the proper, you know, uniform. Are you going to be building a mock soon? <laughs> the problem is that at the moment, most of the Lego I have is completely used up in them. Um, so I built all of my old Lego City, all of my old stuff. I actually built a mock a couple months back for oh shit, it was a uh, Shakespeare. So it's the his play called The Twelfth Night. I'll show you a picture on my phone because I have a picture of of what I built. I want it's not a complete scene, but it was just for a stop motion I started doing for an English project. So. I had like this, uh, this mini garden room thing. One afternoon, like one afternoon at some point. Yeah, the Falcon or the Taj Mahal, those are great choices. So that's that's all right. The, the mock. In terms of Star Wars mock, I really want to do one at some point soon. And in May, I'm planning to buy some pick a brick cups, hopefully, and maybe take apart some of my sets. And if you have any ideas for what I should try and build, then I'll um I'll try and oh, I don't have much inspiration at the moment for what to do with um what to actually build. So many things at the moment. I mean, so many people are building Scarif. Uh, I feel like building Tatooine would be quite good now that I've got the uh, Sandcrawler, and hopefully I can get the uh, Luke's Landspeeder set at some point. Because that would be pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. I saw. I watched your review of it. Oh yeah, Jed is Jed is good as well. It'd be fun trying to build a um a the statue of the the guy. I can't remember his name. Oh, so we're up to eight eight likes on the stream. That is really awesome. Yeah, Jeddah. What what sort of scenes from Jeddah would you build? Would you go for like the giant Jedi statue or? Just the scene with the hover tank where they're in that courtyard. That's probably what I'd do. The the courtyard scene with the assault hover tank thing. Yeah. The problem with having the sand crawler on stream is how much space it takes up. Let's put that on the floor. Oh. <laughs> Um, I'll just put the thing off for a second. <laughs> yeah, the hover tank. <laughs> well, at least I didn't film on the camera or the laptop or stuff. <laughs> or the Lego. <laughs> and the stream site is delayed. You, you, you'll just be seeing that now. <laughs> oh dear, it fell on the phantom a bit. Well, that that's my backboard thing that I've... <laughs> That's the backboard thing I've got. <laughs> Just to focus on the stream. <laughs> oh, I was. I guess I probably should have expected that. <laughs> Sorry. I've just got that resting up there to <laughs> go in place. All right. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> okay, right. Camera back on now. I've reorganised the stuff. I think all the minifigures got crushed though, but there's there's Thrawn, he's still alive. And his chopper as his blind Canaan. There we go. <laughs> They're not very neat. Oh no, I messed, I messed up the landing gear. Put that out, put that down again. Glad it missed the Mac, yeah. Oh god, that would have been bad. <sighs> it didn't really fall far enough. The trajectory wasn't quite right. Okay. Uh, you, I, you, I'd recommend Duck Teeth or Bootag. Yeah, I've got quite a lot of Bootag up there. I've got some posters and things hung up. I've got the... Uh, does anyone else have the... Uh, I'll break, I'll take it down. 
Yeah, here we go. Right, even hanging up, it, right? it's the Lego Batman movie posters that they have. I haven't seen the film yet, but all of them, I probably won't. But cool poster. I got it from a toy shop. They were giving it out with every purchase of Lego. So, yeah. Go take what's free. Yeah, the time delay is quite bad. Basically, I've optimized it so that you're not buffering as much, but so that you're um. So, but it might be a bit more delayed. It's not too bad. It, it's not a problem. The movie's good. Yeah, I heard that. Do you know what's Do you know what it's out of the box office at the moment? I'll check that. Uh, box office. There you go. So it's currently at two hundred fifty-six million. Wow. I think they had a budget of like sixty or seventy. Or I think it was about ninety billion. Ninety. Million. Okay. So that's pretty good. Um. All right. So keep going on with the build. How long we've we been streaming for now? Half an hour. I'm going to be doing longer ones in the future. All right, sorry, back. <laughs> Just seen something quite funny on the news. Yeah. That. Okay. All right. Yeah. Do you mean guests on the live stream then? That'd be quite cool, actually. As in, well, I'm doing the basic version of live streaming with um, Google Hangouts. And it's quite easy, I think, to just get other people on the stream. So if you want to come on the stream or anyone else wants to, or I can invite them. I know that'd be probably quite a cool thing to do, and it's really easy to do. You just invite them into a call or something. Oh, more stickers. So not this live stream probably, but yeah, I'm not going to end it straight away after the uh, after I finish building. I'll do chatting with you for a bit until you get bored, that sort of thing. Oh, you got to go. Well. See you hopefully in the next live stream or on or comments, that sort of thing. Uh, have a good day. Also, Ethan Network, congratulations on 600 subscribers. Hopefully I can get there eventually. I think I'm on 145 at the moment, but working my way up try my best that sort of thing just checking i've got the right stick oh no i'm doing it on the wrong one okay I'm trying to just get the sticker lined up nicely it's quite difficult to do it on the curved pieces there we go that's nice okay yeah i, I really liked the haul from earlier I've, I've got the carbon freezing chamber and i think it's a great set to have uh though the main reason I got it at the time was for the Boba Fett minifigure, but now I'm not. It's it's not really about that. It's more just for the uh, set itself, I guess, because I got the actual slave one after that, which is obviously a better Boba Fett minifigure and you know better set in general. It is a cool one though. It comes with the Ugnor and the spare best. Oh no, no, just the Ugnor. 
What camera do I normally use? I'll show you in a second after I've put this stick on. I think you've seen it before, Pesek. It's the same one for, that I've been using for years, oh, since I think 2013, for all my videos that I've done on YouTube. And I guess bring it over. It's I mean I'm not using it for the live stream because it's a uh, it's difficult. You need like HDMI cables and stuff, and I haven't got the right cable. But it's a Canon EOS 100D, which is nice and it does the job. It has it doesn't have 4K, but it has full HD because 4K wasn't a thing back then. It, it serves a purpose. I don't really see the point in going to 4K. I mean, it's, it's nice, but it's not really necessary. We're now on three viewers, and see how much longer the stream go on for. I had to delay at the start. I had to delay the start of it quite a bit today by about twenty-five minutes because uh, stuff I had to have dinner and something. There's, that was a bit of a rush, but that's fine because the stream ended up happening. And there we go. There's a full cockpit for the Phantom and it looks like it's actually very nearly done which is sad as always like I said but happy because it means it's a happy moment as well oh you've got to go as well well as I said congratulations on 600 subscribers and have a good day so see you oh hey brick clicker uh unfortunately the stream's nearly ending but I've I've nearly finished the Phantom but I'll do a bit of a Q and A sort of thing. You're an expert on. Uh, one second. You're an expert on uh, Lego minifigures, aren't you? The uh, the series series is plural, I guess. Um, yeah. I just got a uh, Lego Batman movie minifigure. Two K, two K subscribers. Nice. Ah, uh, hopefully me someday. When did you start? Doing videos. Yeah, I've barely any of the collectible minifigures. I just got a, uh, I just got a Batman movie one, the uh, Pharaoh guy. Got the Ice Queen, the pirate. The, I'm not a big collector of them. I've only, I only buy them every so often. You're doing a stream tomorrow. Well, I'll try and get to it. I probably will be able to as long as I see the notification. These are all the collectible minifigures I have. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Your collection of them is amazing. So, what's the stream about tomorrow? Is it about minifigures? 7 p.m. UK. Oh, same time as mine was meant to be. Ended up getting delayed a bit, but <laughs> these things happen. Okay. Oh, I've done that wrong. I'm gonna have to. Luckily, this was the right type of piece. What's your tip? Oh, 2K special. What are you doing in it? Just stuff? I'm sure it'll be awesome, whatever it is. Oh, well, it looks like we're pretty much done on the Phantom here. But I'll take you through the features and stuff first, I guess, as part of, as an early part of the review. There we go. Uploading a video now. Well, I'll watch it straight off the stream because yeah, we're nearly done, I guess. Yeah, I really like your videos there. What, what what are your tips to getting to so many subscribers then? Is is there a is there a way? <laughs> there we go. This is it. That's the set. Thanks for two K. Yeah. Well, you deserve it. Your videos are really cool. The minifigure ones, especially. How many how many do you have total now of the uh, collectible minifigures? Oh. Must be difficult to count, but. 
clear these away. First spring loaded shooter. Okay, well, this set. Yeah, I know you've got tons of those. They're really cool. Um, if I didn't collect Star Wars, I'd probably collect those. Or maybe uh, Nexo Knights looks pretty cool at the moment, too. So it's, I like everything, to be honest. <laughs> so how's this meant to be folded away? Let's see, how's it done here? Okay, so just straight along there. <laughs> that makes sense. So if you had to give me, if you had to give someone tips to gaining subscribers, well, what would you say? Is that what you're going to be doing in the stream tomorrow then, I guess? One sec. Oh, yeah, this set's looking really cool. Uh, put Chopper into it. And, yeah, I really like it. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. 7 p.m. Okay. I'll have a video out tomorrow. I'm trying to do daily uploads at the moment for as long as I can. I managed to do it for a couple months during December. Well, no, like a couple months, just just up to December and like just afterwards. And I don't know if I quite made it that far, but I did it at least all of December for the advent calendars, plus like mostly an extra video each day. Which was pretty fun. It's just easier when you have when you've got holidays. Quite a lot busier at the moment. There we go. Caden goes into the ship, which is which is nice. Yeah, we mentioned earlier that um, guests on streams would be a good thing for my future streams. So if anyone watching wants to like, talk on Google Hangouts or something, then that would be fun. Right, let's fire this. Well, that, I like. Oh, I've lost one of them already. Mm -hmm. well, that's, that's a nice way of firing them. It's quite unique. Does it pop back on you? Really well integrated. Unlike the Y-Wing, actually. I don't think that's that well done. It goes sideways. And so they click it back. Can we call after this and hangouts? Yeah, sure. That'd be nice to do. Uh, if you want to come on one of my streams in the future, just send me a message on something. On email, jackbricks123 at gmail.com. I like your uh, your ask click your ask brick clicker videos. They're they're nice. Yeah, what do you think the uh, series seventeen minifigure is going to be? The uh, the the extra one. Like the, the special thing. Uh, what's it called? The the one that's blanked out. The new Mr. Gold. Something like that. Back up to four watches. All right. Nearly hit ten likes on the video. Not sure. <laughs> yeah. It looks like it might be something from the Lego Batman mo movie because if you look at the, uh, I've got the thing, series eight here and series, tw oh, Batman movie figures here. He's on the back here some for some reason. Might be something to do with that. No idea. The only, the only, the only other thing I want to know about is uh, whether they're going to be doing a, uh, what they're going to be doing for May the fourth. That's what I'm most excited for, for the uh, Star Wars minifigure. Because those are always really exciting for me. Yeah. Wow, so you've been doing videos for nine months now and 2,000 subscribers already. That's right. I'm jealous. <laughs> Can you join the stream for what? So you mean. 
the Hangouts thing. Yeah, you can you can join the Hangouts. Do I have to? One second, I'll just go in and try and invite you to. It. If that if that's what you mean. I'll just sort this out. There we go, I've sent an invite. Hopefully you got that. Have you got it? Yeah, there's a bit of delay with the uh, stream thing. Hello, guys. Hello. Yep. I'm on. Right. Bit that. Yeah, cool. Uh, it's cool stream. It's a nice set. I think like, it's a bit of a price at forty pound, but cool set. Yeah, it's um. I got it discounted in the U.S. because oh, it, that's good. it ended up being like twenty pounds, which is good. Mhm. Mm Very good. Yeah, I'm looking forward to your stream tomorrow. Yeah, it should be about seven o'clock, something like that. Yeah. I'm at seven. I tried to, tried to schedule, schedule mine for seven today, but it ended up being like seven, half seven. Yeah, that's my mum might be like that. I should be on time. Though. I'll be doing brick click a game and shout outs and all that stuff. So. Oh, nice. It'll be fun. Little stream. I don't know how long it'll be, but. Yeah, yeah. I would, I would stream for longer, but I've got like, oh, it didn't, didn't take long enough to do the thing. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I just um, just about to record my audio for my two K subscriber special thing. I'm just getting everything ready, and then I'm going to record the audio in a minute. I'm doing a, a top five video soon on the new summer sets for Star Wars. So, oh, right, that'll be pretty good. I'll watch that like and comment. Do you, for my 2K special, do you want to do like a quote saying how you like Brick or something like that? Oh, I don't know. What. How about I, um, I'll um email you. Wait, what, is, is the email just. I've got an idea. After we finish the stream, I'll talk to you about it, yeah. Yeah, okay. I'll, I need to. I'll look through your channel to give get more of a. Like, get a good quote. Okay. 2011 subscribers at the moment. Yeah, I the my channel growth has been really slow the last few days. Two thousand and twelve. Just went. Oh, nice. Um, yeah, the, just if you have fun, other people will have fun. And yeah, you should do because that minifigure collection got me a lot of subs. Yeah, I think the uh, the best videos or the most successful ones that I've done have been like Star Wars collections. Yeah, people like collections, big videos. I think. Yeah. How many people are watching the stream? I, I think it's just us two. So how about I end the stream and then we can talk about the quote thing? Sure. Right. Great stream. Well done. I'll see you in a minute. Yeah. Bye. Oh. I'll just mute you and then do this thing. Are we live still? Yeah, I think. Wait, I th I'll just say thanks for watching everyone who's watched the stream. So I'm ending it now. All right. Bye. Bye.